My name is Dawn Carnes. I originally qualified as a psychologist. I did a degree in psychology initially. And after that, I went to work in human resources in the city of London. Following that, I retrained as an osteopath. And I did a five-year part-time training course as an osteopath, then worked clinically for around five to 10 years. And then I did a PhD with Queen Mary University of London at Bart's the London School of Medicine and Dentistry. And after that, I became a full-time academic researcher. I'm based in two institutions. One in London, which is Queen Mary University of London, where I work as the director for the National Council of Osteopathic Research. And I do that one day a week. And then I do four days a week in Switzerland at the Universities of Applied Sciences, where I lead a unit of research for musculoskeletal health care and mobility. And again, that's full-time research with teaching as well. So it's managing the bachelor and the master's in osteopathy. One of the best things about working in a university environment is that you're working with like-minded people who are also very curious and very passionate about their areas of research. And that's something that I found inspiring and has motivated me to pursue a career in research. And what I particularly like is the environment where people share their knowledge and that's very important if you want to move forward in your career and also improve your thinking and discover new things. The choices of projects that you want to undertake, it's quite difficult to get funding for those projects, but once you get the funding, then you can really explore and answer the questions that you wanted to answer years ago, maybe when you're in clinical practice. There's quite a lot of training that you have to do to understand the research methodologies that are appropriate to answering your research questions. But once you have those, you have some experience, often you have the support of the university and other specialists around you that enable you to answer those research questions that you have about your practice. And that's the joy of doing research. There's lots of opportunity, not only in the UK, but also abroad. So if there are research posts or teaching posts at other universities, um, then there is the possibility of working abroad. And I always think that if you see something as an opportunity, then it probably is one. So you're better off taking it because otherwise you might regret it in the long run.